Do your nonstick pans work perfectly at first, but after a few months or a year, everything starts to stick? If you're tired of replacing your nonstick pans every year, this video's for you. Prudent Reviews. Hi, I'm Andrew with Prudent Reviews, where we help you find the best products for your home. If you're new to this channel, subscribe for in-depth and unbiased reviews of cookware, kitchen knives, appliances, and more. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through 10 easy ways to make your nonstick pans last longer. Let's get right into it. Metal utensils can scratch and chip the nonstick surface. So never use metal spatulas, tongs, forks, or any other utensils. Instead, use wooden, plastic, silicone, or nylon kitchen tools. Nonstick cookware doesn't perform well when using high heat, and exposing it to extreme temperatures can damage the coating. If you're searing, browning, frying, or cooking ingredients that benefit from high heat, grab a stainless steel pan or a cast iron skillet. With nonstick, keep the stove setting at medium or lower. Most nonstick pans are oven safe, but never exceed 500 degrees Fahrenheit. Some nonstick pans can only handle up to 300 degrees Fahrenheit and some are not oven safe at all due to plastic or wooden handles. On a similar note, never use a nonstick pan to broil. The direct heat from the top down will break down the nonstick coating and cause harmful fumes to release. Instead, use a stainless steel pan, which can tolerate much higher temperatures and won't break down under the hot flames. Cooking sprays can release a sticky buildup that's hard to wash off, even if the label says it's safe for nonstick pans. All the extra scrubbing will wear down the pan surface over time. Some cookware brands, including Anilon, warn customers to never use cooking spray, and doing so will void their warranty. Instead, use oil or butter, and if you're watching your calories, get an oil mister to control the quantities. Cutting ingredients with sharp utensils or a knife while they're cooking in the pan is a recipe for disaster. In fact, it's the easiest way to scratch and ruin the pan's nonstick coating. If you need to cut an ingredient, remove it from the pan and cut it on the cutting board. This tip seems obvious, but cutting ingredients while they're in the pan is something that people do all the time, and it's the quickest way to destroy your pan. Don't put your nonstick pans in the dishwasher. Even if the manufacturer claims the pan is dishwasher safe, wash them by hand with warm soapy water and a soft sponge. Make sure you use the soft side of the sponge. The exposure to high temperatures, hot steam, and harsh chemicals in the dishwasher will break down the pan's coating over time. When you're hand washing, avoid metal scrubbing brushes and always dry the pan thoroughly. Although it's tempting to cool down and clean your pans immediately after cooking, do not rinse or soak them in cold water while they're still hot. Doing so will result in thermal shock, which is when the pan is exposed to a rapid change in temperature, causing it to expand or contract unevenly. When the stress or shock is stronger than the material, it can cause the pan to warp. Wait until the pan is fully cool before washing it. Incorrectly storing your pans can lead to scratches, especially if you're trying to save space by stacking your cookware. Don't stack your cookware unless you're using a liner or cloth to protect its surface. You can buy pan protectors online for cheap, and it's worth the small investment. Don't store food in a nonstick pan. Tomato sauces, lemon juice, wine, and other acidic foods can break down the pan's coating, especially if you leave these foods in the pan overnight or for multiple days. If you want a pan that will last, avoid ceramic nonstick pans. The ceramic coating is notorious for breaking down and causing food to stick after just a few months, even if you maintain it properly. Instead, invest in a pan with a PTFE nonstick coating and look for brands that have multi-layer coatings like ScanPan and Made In. Hexclad is another interesting option, which is a nonstick stainless steel hybrid. The cooking surface has peaks and valleys. The peaks are steel and the valleys are nonstick. The raised steel protects the nonstick material from being scratched and extends the life of the pan. I'll link to my reviews of these brands in the description below. I'll also link to websites that sell these brands so you can compare prices. Those are affiliate links, so if you click and buy, I'll earn a commission, but at no extra cost to you. If you found this video helpful, you need to watch this step-by-step -step guide where I explain the simplest and easiest way to clean stainless steel pans. And don't forget to subscribe by clicking the logo right here. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.